Hey, what's going on guys? Girls Hard Drive, and welcome back to the bench. There's another brand new one we're going to check out real quick. Actually, what I want to do is check out my new camera angle and a little swivel thingy, my bopper right here. So, let's see how things go. See how clear it is. Number 19. Tight box. live videos I almost hate finding that end of the tape I hope you're getting your antenna systems done. Clean, corrosion free, none of that wimping. It's cold outside now. <laughs> Get it done now. I've been preaching how many decades? In the fall and in the spring. We're not going to pop it open or nothing. I might even open up a 655. I still have to get those done yet. For these two. For another truckload. I know. 29.6. See, we can get a different angle now. We go up, we go down, swivel around, get her all in there. Well, kind of. Got another coax length and class C amplifier to get done here. Yeah, so it all can show. Anyways, let's see what we got. Take this plug out when we're working on something else. And stick in a 100. Power's power wide open. Looks like the power's pretty low on this one. But okay, here it is out of the box. Right, take a look at that. Now, let's take a look at it nice and close. A lot of distortion, okay? And just like, I don't know how many others. Right, can you see that again? Watch it. Intermodulation distortion. Stop watching the meter. That looks like a pretty good angle. But I can't see it from here, that's what sucks. Alright, just watch them both at the same time. Completely wasted power distortion, which is also going to change your frequency response. And we'll pull the power down. And of course, this isn't tuned at the CB channels or 11 meter. Power all the way down. It's actually even worse. A single tone. It's not too bad. You know what? Hold on a second. 
I gotta get it unboxed anyway and get it done. Mondays are always fun. Every day is dangerous, I'll put it that way. Post office, post office, post office. So here's a let's zoom on out. I wish this thing had a remote, but it don't. 655. position and not bump into it. But I can get it out of the way quick and easy. No more tripod in the way. Might have to design something similar to what I got. What I'm using it might work out pretty good. And uh, if I, I'm thinking about an S8 Plus. Now it would be really cool right there. Dual cameras, one right on the spectrum analyzer plus a monitor that I can see. It's kind of strange doing a video when you can't see nothing. But I think it doesn't matter. And yeah, sometimes. Depends on what you're trying to show. You don't know if your head's in the way of the camera or what. Bother to test the seat because we know it's going to be noisy. Guarantee this one's going to be cleaner. Watch it put me on the spot. Yeah, much cleaner. Let's get on in there. And then with the advent of Max Mod and the proper tune and frequency response updates, these things are pretty cool. They all have it. It's nothing major, but with the um, power all the way down, you see it, it barely modulates. There we go. One of each out of the box. Yes, that's looking really good. Okay. Let's check it out a little deeper. Go to one kilohertz. Let's go to thirty kilohertz. Yeah, it's hard to ask for more. Well, let's let's go a little bit deeper in this. And Scott, you've mentioned someone said the highs. You know, yes, they're hard to contain. Very hard to contain. Let's zoom on out so you can actually see what's going on here. Yeah, I got a mess up there. Alright, uh, I believe you can see that. <laughs> That's 1K. I gotta step this up and go down in frequency. There's 74. Now watch the spectrum analyzer. 21, 25, now you can see it dropping off quick, you can see the voltage, you can see the frequency, there's the volts in, as we get to 3, it drops way off, but even at 3 you can see the splatter, and it drops off heavily. But there is nothing there at like over 3,200. It's almost flat as a pancake. Well, not flat, but 
there's not much of a frequency response. The mic gains wide open. And this is typical. Now I'm going to turn the echo on after I unkey it. There's echo. Even less. Okay? See the highs? And the 955 is just as bad. <clears throat> I'm sure a lot of techs are realizing, <clears throat> and also the end user, when you go to sideband and try to use a noise canceller, it's like a mud duck. Unless you have one of mine. But anyways, uh, it looks like that's the end of this video. Just want to check it out. I might put it up. I might not. There's two of them right out of the box. You know who it is. If you need to get in touch with me, Facebook. Catch y'all later. Click, click.